So that being said, you've heard a little bit about who I am and what I do. Um, I do a lot, and that means that it hasn't always been easy for me to get to where I am today. Um, I'm a lot of times I feel stressed. A lot of times I feel out of place when I look around my classes, and I'm the only girl of tan skin. Um, a lot of times I feel like I'm going to fail or I'm not going to do well. Um, and those are sometimes good feelings because that's what motivates you to do the best that you can do. You don't want to let people stereotypes be right. So um, a lot of that is what's pushed me to kind of get to where I am today. Um, but I also think that in my time, you know, with my academics and my studies habits and my work extracurricular activities, I have really learned the importance of just getting the job done when it needs to get done. So my mom's always been like amazed at how I would come home from school and just immediately start on my homework. She wouldn't even tell me. She's like, I never had told you to do your homework because you would always just come home and do it. And I don't really know what it was in me that would do that, but I think without having that, like, schedule in my life of just, okay, I'm going to go home, and the first thing I do is do my homework, um, I don't think I would be at Stanford if it weren't for that sort of mentality I have. Um, So definitely this, like, learning, when you have, when you're interested in a lot of things and have a lot of passions and have a lot of things that you want to do, it's really important to have those time management skills and making sure that you're getting the tasks that need to be done um, first and then you can have fun with your friends and watch TV or go out to eat or watch a movie, whatever it may be. It's also really important to have a future in mind, so making sure that you know what your goals and aspirations are. That doesn't mean you have to be super specific. I still am not entirely sure what I'm going to do post-college. I know I like math and data and analyzing data. But that doesn't mean I have, like, a very specific job title in mind. Um, The more, the goal is, goals can be very broad, but they have to be motivating. Something that, that is a reach and that you can hopefully get there eventually. Um, So I'm, hopefully you've got some advice about, you know, how you can, pursue areas of higher education and how you can get there. Um, I can imagine that you all have great goals and aspirations, and I would love to hear from you all um, and see if there's any way I can help or motivate you. Uh, But thank you for listening, and um, yeah, I hope to hear from you all. Bye.